Don't you agree? Adding images to a page or post is a great way to illustrate important information and motivate readers to go over your content instead of just skimming through it. Additionally, we are sure you want your writing piece to have some visual appeal. However, inserting images can sometimes be challenging, especially if you want to create a well-organized space. Fortunately for us, Gutenberg offers some text wrapping options to achieve the perfect layout when working with images easily. My name is Valerie, you're watching the Motopress YouTube channel. If you're new here, welcome! And in this tutorial, I will provide the full detail about wrapping text around an image using the default WordPress editor. Before we get into the specifics, definitely give this video a thumbs up if you like getting your content from WordPress. Make sure you're subscribed and you've got the bell notification turned on so you know as soon as our videos go live. As I said before, the Gutenberg editor brings options to place text around the image in an elegant way in WordPress. I'll show you how to do that easily with no coding and design experience. Furthermore, Gutenberg brings many advantages like more clear source code of the website, speed, security, and usability. A quick note about aligning versus wrapping. Aligning text and image positions the two items next to each other in two separate columns, but wrapping for its part involves more interaction with the image since the text uh, positions itself around the image. There are several ways to have the text wrap around an image placed on a WordPress website. Gutenberg have different blocks and you can use them in combination with their parts and features, which gives you additional options for the wrap. One of them involves an image block and a paragraph block. Start by placing an image inside an image block. The next block will be the text block. Paste the needed text. When done with the text, select the image block and set the alignment left or right. The text immediately repositions itself on the opposite side of the alignment chosen for the image. When the image is aligned left, the text will move into place on the right side, and when the image is aligned right, the text moves to the left. With the center aligned image, the text stays beneath it. So this is how the image looks after wrapping text around it. If the text doesn't move, it means the image is too wide and there is not enough space for the text. But nothing to worry about. Gutenberg and its image block allow image resizing. Drag dots around the image to automatically change its size. The image block isn't the only way to add pictures to your WordPress website. If you want to display multiple photos, it may take sense to use the gallery block. The gallery contains individual image blocks and organizes them into columns. And sometimes you might need to display some text alongside your gallery. For instance, you might want to provide a supporting explanation. The good news is that you can use the same alignment settings we discussed earlier in this video. This means you can simply add a paragraph block above or below the gallery and then insert the text that you want to position alongside your images. Once all the pieces are in place, uh, click on the gallery block 
and select the alignment icon and there you can choose a line left which will position your text to the right of the gallery alternatively you can select a line right and display the text to the left of the gallery mm, block images media and text block also guarantees perfect alignment of text to the image without compromising composition and layout that's a good reason you should use this block moreover there is one more benefit it improves website design on mobile devices too, for every part of the website to be visible and readable. Adding the media and text block is as easy as adding any other block. As its name suggests, this block groups two different types of content into one. The first one is medium, for example, image or video that you can add by uploading or using media library. And the second one is space for the text content, such as paragraphs, bullet lists, or title. Media and text block always aligns image and text side by side, no matter how much text you write. The toolbar above the block offers several options. If your active sim supports that, you can set media and text block as wide or full width. Let's click Change Vertical Alignment. These settings will alter where the text appears in relation to the media. For example, if you opt for a line middle, uh, the text will align uh, with the center of the accompanying image or video. You can also choose where you want to place an image or video by clicking on show media on left, show media on the right. We see it's a quite a good looking block with a great number of controls uh, but we should mention it, it won't wrap the text around the image as you would expect. These are two different columns, uh, so the text container will stay fixed. Remember this fact. But also note, thanks to stack on mobile function, images and text are nicely displayed on mobile devices. Adding images in line works best for such blocks as paragraph, list, group, and quote. In many cases, it's necessary to insert images and text side by side. The image has to be next to the right text. Let's use the list block for this example. We know that the image block cannot be nested inside the list. A solution to this limitation is to use inline images. Press Shift plus Enter uh, to go to the next line without proceeding to the next item in the list. At the top of the editor, click the arrow on the block picker and select inline image. The image will be inserted, however, it will be scaled to a width of 150 pixels. To resize the image to its original size, enter its original width in the box floating inside the image. You can also scale it to a different width if you wish. If you wish to remove the image, just select it and press the delete key. Note, however, that's not possible to give the inline image a caption. You'll notice that by default the image inside the list block are aligned left. You can, however, center align the image using some custom CSS. 
Gutenberg friendly themes are always a better way to go, but you should be fine to perform this task in any WordPress theme with the third party Gutenberg add ons like Gatwin. You can also go further and create fancier shapes and backgrounds for your text and media content with a section block. Just remember these two crucial things. The rapid text around images might not display exactly in the editor as your live post or page, so you should always preview to see the effects before hitting publish. To wrap things up, choosing the Gutenberg editor for your WordPress website gives you the best tools for wrapping text around images differently. We've made sure that the steps in this guide are relatively simple to follow as it is created with beginners in mind. After watching this video, you can test out all the offered methods and choose the best one for you. You can achieve an easy editing content routine and a well-looking design simultaneously. Wrapping text around an image will give your readers a strong visual clue as to what your text is about. It is a great way to make any website look more appealing. Motopress in its turn offers you a wide variety of rental, WooCommerce themes and themes with scheduling software integrated. Visit motopress.com and you'll see it with your own eyes. Also, follow us on social media. We are constantly sharing Motopress news and promotions on Instagram and Twitter. We also have a community group on Facebook where you will meet Motopress fans, share your experience, or get support. So check it out too. Thanks for watching. See you next time.